Welcome back to Beyond Mankind. And we have finally made it outside of the starting place. These apartments or whatever they are. And we are here out on the streets. And we are going to pull out our pistol. Because that is what we have bullets for right now. So we need to head to our pater. And see what's going on. As we explore out here. Soldiers on guard and can't pay attention. It's over here. Explore. Absolutely nothing. It is like literally pitch black. It should not be this dark out here. I tell you, these indie games don't know how to simulate darkness. Those wolves came here, right? I'm not seeing much at all. Except for this. Drink some wine. Alright, let's hand this date over. Only found one thing. Then we'll hang Oh, bullets. Nice. That's good. Bullets and medical kits. And standing on the bodies. Many skeletons. Okay. Let's ignore that. So, exploring paid off. Got a little forest over there. I'm not going to go that way. Now let's go where we should be. Just here. Watch where you shoot and point that weapon at, sir. Ammo, I will take. Thing, don't want to use that because there is no. There we go. Reload. Okay. Now we have bullets. So I'm guessing you are a painter or adoptive father. Take some water. All right, we're good. We're not thirsty. Not gonna talk to him yet. Okay. Got first aid kit. Got canteen. Put some water in. Okay, and we can't go upstairs. So let's talk to you, boy. Every time I descend to Earth, I can't help but feel nostalgic. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, I was born before the Great Disaster, but I never knew this world. Uh, see, I grew up between walls built out of moon dust bricks and helium-3 processors converting the lunar regular. What? And yeah, I never felt, never felt so comfortable there. I only feel at home when I'm back here. Why are you telling your adoptive son that? Pater, we found this data tablet. Vishpala became concerned after reading. Well, I suppose that's why Vishpala didn't say anything to me on the radio. Let me see what's got her scared. All right, let's hand it over. Here it is. Ha! You see this? She is, without a doubt, the best Sysop I know. Decrypting this shouldn't have been so easy. Well, let's see what it says. Marcus Mueller. I knew it. He took nah. refuge in his mother's house when the world fell apart. From Aztec. Yeah, yeah, I know all this. Here's some notes on the project. 
No, it can't be. Mueller, you may have been crazy, but you were a genius. What are you getting at, Pater? It far exceeds what I expected. It's so exciting, so important, that I'm shaking with fear. Shaking in my boots. Um, his father was also very scared to read. We should destroy it. Never seen you tremble over anything. Let's destroy it. I would never think of destroying this. Damn. My fear has nothing to do with what Vishpala may have to discover. You failed. I fear for what may happen to me. Above all, I fear for you. You know why we're here? Why we risk our lives more than others? You know why returning to Earth is our only option at this point? Why? Because we need the resources. We loot here to survive up there. The colonization of Mars has failed. It remains a hostile planet where living conditions are too harsh. Well, we need the resources. That's true, but it doesn't completely answer my question. We must return to Earth because it was the cradle of humankind. It's our home. Take a good look at these once proud buildings. Now, we live in dark times. Progress and ideas are viewed as threats. Well, freedom has been given up to ensure survival. So, this discovery will certainly redirect my life and yours. If not in them. If it's so dangerous, then let's destroy it. <laughs> yeah. You still understand nothing. Whatever. If our people don't return to Earth, it'll be our end. Day's a day that I put on your shoulders a weight that's burdened me. I'm very sorry. I want you to promise me that you'll follow my goal when I'm gone. This cause surpasses all others. All right, I swear to you on my blood and honor. I respect you, Peter, but I can't commit my life to this cause that I don't understand. I didn't expect it, but I, uh, I understand. I guess I can't hide my disappointment. In that case, I only ask you save the data tablet. It's a favor to me. Peter. Do you know who Den Aoyama is? I heard of her. She's a renegade who founded some sort of sect on an island off of California. Right? Don't be taken in by the official propaganda. She was a top geneticist in the colonies. She had the well, that's a lot of relation points for what we said before. Old scientific facility. Doesn't matter. We're not going to talk to her much. It's called Hope. A place that you found years ago before you adopted me. I remember you telling the story. I wouldn't have expected any less. Den Aoyama and her people are strong enough not to fear retaliation from the Senate. And brave enough to know what to do with this data tablet. We must get it to her. Well, I'm in contact with her. I'm going to send her the coordinates to an extraction point where an HOPE transport will come to pick you and the data tablet up. It is of the utmost importance that you keep that data safe. I trust you. Are you not coming? No, unfortunately. I, I need to speak to the rest of the team. We need them on our side. They gotta keep this secret. I'll return with them to the transport that's already coming for us. I'm so sorry to burden you with this responsibility. I love you. Someday, the sun will shine warmly again. On this earth. One, this is six. Eight right. contacts approach. 300 meters northwest. Uh -oh. Here to be armed. They must be from the colonial transport we saw five minutes ago. Orders? The transport? Here? With a full squad? That makes no sense. Digger! Hold your defensive positions! They may be hostile! Sir, all channels are oh, open. Now they're deploying to attack. Digger 6, Digger 2, hold your weapons. They are friendlies. They have come to pick up what we found. Two, what have you done? Belay that order, Digger! Weapons free! Shit! One, what? they outnumber us. We'll need support. Six out. They were fast. Listen to me well. I thought they were friendly. Killed and go to that hope transport now. Good luck. Oh, 
the transport. Here we go. Well, we're going to do that in the next part. Feel free to hit that like button and comment. And if you're really feeling daring, hit that subscribe button as I am worth it. And I will catch you then.